Hello guys, so a few videos ago you saw that I was talking about getting cocoons of some species, of a few species that I said I would get, and uh, those, all those cocoons came in, and I'm going to show you all of those. Now I personally like to buy cocoons first, then breed them, then raise the eggs so that I can see the moth. And then go to see the caterpillars. But, and then those were the case for these guys. Because I couldn't find any listings of eggs for them. We can start off with these guys first. These are Antarea Jana. And I ordered a male and a female, so two cocoons. And, uh, obviously, I was sent three. So, here we go. Male, male. And see, that's about that big on my finger. And then we have this humongous pupa of a female. Look how big that is compared to, like, let's put a quarter. Look at that. Look at this. Look at this. That's just too big. It's going to be a pretty nice big moth. See on the wings, you can see that they're... Some nice wing design on there. Alright, next species. This is the one that I was most excited for. This is Rodenia fuhax. Personally, I like about the species that the cocoons are just green. This one I bought a male and a female. And they came all opened up like this, which is okay. Show the male first. Smaller species, but if you know me in real life, you'd know that I like breeding a lot of the smaller species. Silk moth. Then we have this guy. This is the female. These guys are going to hatch around October. Show you the video of that. That was the female. Alright, next species. This one I really like because of the cocoons. I think they're kind of cool. It's uh, Curricula. Trifenestra, I think that's how you say it. We got a male and a female. I bought a pair. Alright, let's just show the male. Stick that down for a second. Here's the bigger female. Now the uh, Rodenia Fuhax are from Japan. The Antarea Jana and these guys are from like somewhere in Africa, I'm pretty sure. I think I think Antarea Jana isn't our Asian one. Let's be outside the point. This guy, this next one is Saturnia Pavona. And this is an 
European species. I have six cocoons. Uh, three males and three females. I ordered four, but the guy gave me two more, which is always welcome. I've opened them all up, and we can show you. They're all black, so I think they're going to hatch soon. smaller male see the size difference between them so yeah Updates on Antarea Hakamani. I think two of the three have died so far. One of them has started feeding good. Now, which is good. But more on that later. We still have a ton more eggs that needs to hatch. And that's all of them. So, this season you're going to see Rodinia Fugax, Tulicula Trifenestra, Antarea Jana, and... Saturnia Pavona. Thanks for watching, guys.